Hi, this is Mohamed Shakil here and you're watching a split muff coupling being done in the part design and the generator shape design workbench in Katia V5. So finally it was assembled in the assembly design workbench. So uh, in this video I'm going to show you some of the parts uh, and uh, the technique which was used to uh, do the assembly as well as the design of uh, this particular split muff coupling. So basically coming to the uh, use of this coupling, couplings are basically used to do the transmission of power between the shafts. So here uh, as you can see this is a shaft. So uh, if I hide these objects you can see that this is a shaft over here and we have a parallel running key over here which is uh, having which is uh, passing through the slots. So if I hide this you can see you can see just a key over here. So this is the key uh, which you know which uh, holds the shaft and the lower split muff. Uh, together, so I'll unhide this part. So as I rotate and as I show, uh, as I do the walkthrough of this design, you can uh, have a look from different angles how it looks like the split muff coupling. So that the people who uh, who come over here to know about the split muff coupling on their projects, they can get a uh, you know proper idea how the split muff coupling looks like and how the working goes. So uh, as you can see, this is a square bolt. So the square bolt holds the uh, upper split muff and the slow, uh, this lower uh, split muff. So basically, the split muff couplings are having uh, it's it's uh, being split longitudinally into halves, and the joint faces are perfectly machined. So these are the joint faces, and they are perfectly machined. So. So the different parts that was used uh, for the design was one is a shaft over here, which is pretty simple to create. So I'll hide and I'll show you just the shaft. So the shaft is having a small keyway, and it's having a small chamfer over here, and uh, you can increase the length as well because the length is not a problem. It's just have to come out of the uh, uh, the split muffs. So a bolt is created and a square bolt is created. So to create the square bolt, uh, extrude command was used uh, to profiles was created and extruded and then trimmed. Uh, and that was done in the generator shape design workbench. So here a small uh, chamfer is being given. And uh, if, if you don't uh, prefer to uh, put the bolt in the alternate uh, you know alternate alignments if you want all, all the bolts uh, heads to be on the top and the uh, uh, the hexagonal nuts on the bottom you can just go for the circular pattern uh, which was uh, used in creation of uh, what do you call the upper housing I mean upper uh, upper split muff and the lower split muff so this is about uh, the split muff coupling uh, which is uh, being designed and assembled in the Kitia V5. So I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you got some idea regarding the split muff coupling and how it looks like, how it's working is. And uh, keep watching. And uh, thank you so much.